Hello, Fofamid here, and today we're going to be talking about a free VTubing app where all you need is either your MacBook, your PC, and an iPhone with Face ID. This video is brought to you by Private Internet Access. For fast, reliable, secure internet browsing to make it seem like you're from any country in the world, please click on the link in the video description down below. So this entire video is going to be filmed only using the iPhone and the free app we're talking about today. In a previous video, I did talk about how to do full body motion capture with face capture using an iPhone, a custom VTubing app and um, VR. But this is only using an iPhone and um, basically a Mac or a PC. So you can use it with almost any computer. Just like the other video, we do need to do some things with your VTubing avatar. You need to add the 52 Apple AR kit blend shapes. You'll see the link for resources for that in the video description down below. It can be a bit time consuming. Uh, one advantage is that if you have a really nice VTubing avatar though, uh, there is a way that you can kind of be able to make uh, some of the Apple AR kit blend shape shapes using um, the existing blend shapes that already exist there. But my recommendation though would be to uh, actually go into Blender and make those blend shapes yourself. So here I'm just going through converting my avatar to a VRM. I have also done a video before on how to convert an avatar to VRM, which is basically the most common VTubing avatar format. And you can also see a link uh, in the video description or something should um, pop up in one of the corners over there. And I'll also make sure that I include all the links to any of the software and applications that you need in the description as well. So once you finish converting your avatar to a VRM, you're going to go to your iPhone and go to the app store. It's a free application. So all you have to do is just download and install it, open up iTunes, and then you're going to connect your iPhone to your computer. And then you're going to connect to your iPhone and go to the shared applications, the uh, Ydio app, and you're going to click an avatar into that file. Make sure that you rename your VRM avatar to default.vrm. It's very important to do that because for some reason there's not support for any other avatar file. Now, once you do that, you should be able to open the Ydio app on your phone and you're going to see it loading and by default, it should load your avatar just like normal. And then here you'll be able to see your avatar uh, set up properly for all of the face capture and head movement and also does some body movement as well. And it'd be really nice. Um, and you can also see that it also has support for dynamic bones as well. So it is possible to do VTubing from this app directly on your phone, but it's, I find it wouldn't be as nice uh, considering that there's no real support to change the background as far as I know. Next, we're going to go and download the desktop application so you can be able to uh, record your VTubing either on your MacBook or your PC. So you're going to go to booth.pm and you're going to go look for this application. I'm going to make sure, like I said, the link is going to be in the description down below, and then you're going to download it. And the zip file is actually going to come with both Mac and PC versions. So in this case, since I'm using a PC, I'm actually going to be opening the PC version. What you should do that there are instructions on how to set this up. But in my case, all I had to do is just drop the avatar file in the directory. So basically just put the avatar file in the folder and then it should just open and work just like normal. And here you can see me uh, playing with the, the facial tracking as well as the head movements. And as you can see, the tracking performance is actually really, really great. If you have any questions about how to get this working or you'd like to see any of my other videos, make sure that you stick to the end of the video and you'll be able to see some links. Also, I stream on Twitch and I like to talk about pretty much anything, but I'm also pretty knowledgeable of, about VTubing stuff. So if you want to come in, pop in and say hello, then uh, come check me out there. Bye bye.